Uh huh. To me, school was fun because mm-hmm. I got to interact with so many people. Uh-huh. The fact that nilikuwa naenda shule mbali from home. Yes. I got to see new people. I got to see new faces. Yeah. To learn new things. Mm-hmm. So to me, basically, it was fun. Uh huh. Apart from the studying part. Yes. Like nobody likes books anyways. Mm-hmm. So for me, I didn't like the books as much, but I had to. Mm-hmm. So guys, welcome on my YouTube channel, The Overcomer TV. And uh, today we are going to have such an amazing topic all show on our old days in high school. You know, it used to be crazy if I may say so. You know, waking up every morning and the same routine for four years. It wasn't easy for each and every one of us who have gone through the high school system. And today we are going to be interacting with the Kamanzi Mwenyewe. Ukienda pale TikTok utampata kama Kamanzi254. Ukienda YouTube utampata kama Kamanzi World. Ukienda Facebook utampata kama Kamanzi Kanjogu. And so we are going to be interacting with her. She is going to share her experience in high school all you know that journey for the four years. So you're much welcome Kamanzi. Uh, thank you. Thank Kindly you. introduce yourself to us. Okay, my name is Edith, mm-hmm. Edith Njogu, mm-hmm. but I'm well known as Kamanzi, Kamanzi Kanjogu. Yes. Yeah. So Kamanzi, how was it, like for the four years, how was it in high school? Well, in high school, it wasn't bad, but it was tough, mm-hmm. especially for me. Yes. When, uh, I used to commute a long distance. Yeah. From home, which is around sunset, because mm-hmm. when I do around Kamango. Mm-hmm. Uh, not like 30 minutes from Kamango town mm-hmm. and I used to go to school in Gikambura. Mm-hmm. So mainly I would use a matatu and now commuting was not easy. Yes. Yeah. You did that for four years? No, the first year mm-hmm. I was living with my mom's sister. Mm-hmm. So the first year Nilikwa Natoka not so far. Mm-hmm. So I just walked to school. Mm-hmm. But from form two to form four, Nilikwa na have to commute. To which high school? Uh, I was in Gishuru Memorial, mm-hmm. Gishuru Memorial High School in Gikambura. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So tell us, for from the second year, like from around what time did you used to wake up so that you can make it to school without getting late? Uh, nearly, did I wake up at five, mm-hmm. five fifteen latest? Yeah. So that I can prepare, take my tea, mm-hmm. and then leave ten minutes to six. Yes. So that by the time six got. By the time I got to the stage, it's mm-hmm. six, and then ilikuwa na matatu ya six. Mm-hmm. Once I get late, you get that matatu, and I'd wait for the six thirty one, which definitely meant mm-hmm. I was going to be late for school. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So you could prepare for the whip even before you get to school. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> so, like, tell me, how, like, how many days in a week would you get late, or else in a term? Uh, not many. Mm-hmm. I could go even for a whole term without getting late. Yeah. So, so long as I make it to the six matatu. Mm-hmm. But not a lot. Maybe like two or three mm-hmm. a term. Are you naturally an Ari bad or the high school system forced you to wake up early? Yeah, the system had to force me to wake up early. Mm-hmm. I don't like waking up early. Yeah. If only I could make my day start around 12. Yes. I love that. Come on, what, what, do you for, what do you do for a living at 12? Are you self-employed? Who are you? Come on. So I want to ask you, uh, did this waking up early, sometimes getting late and all that, you know, did it affect your performance in class? No, not really. Mm-hmm. Because for me, I believe like what the teacher is teaching uh-huh. is what I need to get. Uh-huh. So I wasn't more of like extra studying yes. or waking up waking up early mm-hmm. to attend the nisome. Yeah. Know. So the time I wake up, I just know ni akujitayarisha na kutoka. Yes. yes. Genius, right? Uh-huh. <laughs> so I want you to, to describe or to define your high school experience for the four years with some very few words. Like, how was it? How would you say it was? Uh-huh. To me, school was fun. Mm-hmm. Because I got to interact with so many people. Uh-huh. The fact that naenda shule mbali from home. Yes. I got to see new people. I got to see new faces. Yeah. To learn new things. Mm-hmm. So to me, basically it was fun. Uh-huh. Apart from the studying part. Yes. Like nobody likes books anyways. Mm-hmm. So for me, I didn't like the books as much, but I had 
to because mm-hmm. that's why you were in school in the first place. Uh-huh. But for me, I just am all about fun. Yeah. Yeah. Were you able to achieve your goal, which? You yeah, I believe I did. Oh, really? I did well enough uh-huh. to get me to the next level of which I didn't even go mm-hmm. just yet. Yeah. So go on Facebook at Sorry? on Facebook at Kamanzi Kanjogu on TikTok Kamanzi254 Instagram uh, Instagram Kamanzi254 and finally on YouTube <laughs> Kamanzi World Twitter Yeah, Kamanzi World too. All right, that's yeah. amazing. So that's our story. Commuting from home to school, it wasn't that easy. Performance in school and such. Keep it tuned at the Overcomer TV. You are an Overcomer. Be transformed. All right.